ask in prayer. Being in accordance to his will, he will do it. Amen. And he is willing. I would like us to stand in the presence of God as we raise our songs, our voices in song, and bring worship to him for he is worthy. Not because we are worthy, but because he is worthy. He has called us to himself. He has opened the doorway. He has given us access to him through his blood. Amen. We who once were afar off have now been made near by his blood. So feel free to, even without a song, give thanks to God. Honor him for he is good and his mercy endures forever. Thank you, Jesus. We honor you and we give you praise. It is because of you that we are here. Not because of any man, not to any man do we gather, but to your name and your name alone. We thank you that you have put us together, O oh God, for a reason and a purpose. Thank you, O oh God, that you have a divine mandate over this meeting. Thank you that you are aware that we are gathered in your name, that nothing can catch you by surprise. Thank you that you know and you are willing to be among us and you are here with us. Thank you, O oh God, for whatsoever we desire in your name. We know that we have in accordance to your will, in accordance to your way, O oh God. So we surrender our lives to you. We give our hopes, our dreams. We come, O oh God, expecting you to do great things, expecting you to come in mighty, wonderful ways, O oh God. Thank you that you have a grand plan. You have a greater plan, O oh God. We give you praise and we worship you. In this place, you are welcome. Holy Spirit of the Sovereign Lord, you are welcome to have your way. Take your place, O oh God, in the heart of every one of us who shall come. We are gathered and gathering in your name, O oh God. We thank you that we have what we ask according to your will, O oh God, that it is done. Thank you that you have given us access to the throne room of God that we can have fellowship we thank you oh God thank you that you are willing thank you that you are here with us to minister to us thank you Jesus we invite you Lord we invite you Jesus
him as the biggest, see him as the most able, see him as the greatest, the greater one. Hallelujah. We choose, Lord, to magnify you, O oh God. We choose to glorify you, to exalt you high above every and any situation, high above any mountain, and high above anything here on earth that is named, that has never ever been named, O oh God. Anything that is seen or unseen, we glorify you far above principalities and powers of darkness. We glorify you, O oh God, for you are worthy of the praise, worthy of the glory. Only you, Jesus, we choose to see. Only you, Jesus, our eyes choose to be fixed on. For you, O oh God, are the greatest. You, O oh God, are worthy. You never change. You are the same. The same great God, we give you praise, oh God, and we honor your name. Lekeshi hana na masiheda, uongezeke hapa duniani, uongezeke chumbinguni, uongezeke hapa hekaluni mwako, ya kwamba mungu kaonekane katika kila jambo, in every situation, oh God, that our eyes, oh God, might be fixed on you and only you. On you and only you.
worship him for he is worthy. He is good regardless. He is great regardless. He is wonderful regardless. He is worthy regardless. He is seated high on the throne regardless. He is worthy of your praise regardless. See, he has kept you alive. See, he has preserved your health. See, he has kept your family. See, your children are growing in the fear and admonition of the Lord. See, your life is coming. It's panning out to his will. See that your future is secure in him. Would you praise him? Would you give him the glory? For he is worthy of the praise. For he will never leave your side. He will never forsake you as he said in his word. And he is faithful to see to it that that what he said will come to pass. Worship him and focus on him. Look to him for only he is worthy. Only he is worthy of the praise. Oh, Shinama Mama Keso Toyote. Oh, you are worthy, Jesus. Oh, only you, Jesus, our eyes see. Only you that our eyes are focused and fixed on. You, oh God, are worthy of the praise. Be glorified in our midst, O oh God. Be exalted in our midst, O oh God. For you are worthy of the praise. You are worthy, O oh God.
your lips for it is he that you came to see it is he that you came to worship oh god be exalted be magnified be glorified
Zote. Kwa kinywa chako mwagie sifa zote kwa mana na weza Mwagie sifa zote kwa mana yeni mku Ame tukuka nyongo ni mwetu You are worthy, O oh God Shia mena de heshia na 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 masigeta Lekaya nuna moshia na 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 heshia na 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 na
congregation of the saints this night we came we came to worship you we came to honor you hallowed be your name hallowed be your name from everlasting to everlasting you are god we worship you who is God but you is God besides you there is none like you there is none who compares with you we worship you we worship you your mass is on you every morning we bless your name oh your love oh God reaches to the heavens your faithfulness to the skies we worship you we worship you Come on, somebody, let's just worship the Lord in the beauty of holiness this night. We worship you, we worship you. We worship you, we worship you, we worship you. Lord God Almighty, you have helped us. It is you that has helped us, oh God. Throughout the seasons of this year, oh God, it is you that has helped us, oh God. We rise up and we sleep because you, Lord, has sustained us. We worship you this night. We worship you. We worship you. We enter your gates with thanksgiving in our hearts. We come into your courts with praise. We praise you. We praise you, we praise you, we praise you, oh God. There's been food on our tables, we bless your name. There's been shelter of our heads, Lord, we bless your name. There's been safety on the roads, Father, we bless your holy name. Lord, you have helped us, you have helped us. We honor you, we honor you tonight, we give you praise. Hallowed be your name, O oh God. Blessed be your holy name, the God who was. And these and this to come, we worship you. We worship you, we worship you. We give you praise, our God. We bless your holy name, our God. We bless your holy name, our keeper. Praise the Lord, my soul. Psalm 104. Praise the Lord, my soul. Lord, my God, you are very great. You are clothed with splendor and majesty. The Lord wraps himself in light as with a garment. He stretches out the heavens like a tent and lays the beams of his upper chambers on their waters. He makes the clouds his chariot and rides on the wings of the wind. He makes winds his messengers, flames of fire, his servants. He set the earth on its foundation. It can never be moved. You covered it with the watery depths as with a garment. The water stood above the mountains. But at your rebuke, the waters fled, and the sound of your thunder they took to flight. Verse 14, he makes the grass grow for the cattle and plants for the people to cultivate, bring forth food from the earth. Verse 16, the trees of the Lord are well watered, well, well watered the cedars of Lebanon that he planted. There the birds make their nests. The stalk has its home in the junipers. The high mountains belongs to the wild goats and crags are a refuge for the hyrax. He made the moon to mark the seasons and the sun to know when to go down. Verse 24. How many are your works, Lord, in wisdom? You made them all. The earth is full of your creatures. They are in the sea, vast and spacious, teeming with creatures beyond number. 
living things both large and small. There the sheep go and f go to and fro, and levier than which you form to frolic there. All creatures look to you to give them their food at a proper time. When you give it to them, they gather it up. When you open your hand, they are satisfied with good things. When you hide your face, they are terrified. When you take away their breath, they die and return to the dust. When you send your spirit, they are created and you renew the face of the ground. May the glory of the Lord endure forever. May the Lord rejoice in his works. He who looks at the earth and it trembles, who touches the mountains and they smoke. I will sing to the Lord all my life. I will sing praise to my God as long as I live. May my meditation be pleasing to him as I rejoice in the Lord. But may sinners vanish from the earth and the wicked be no more. Praise the Lord, my soul. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. I want us just to take time in verse 27 to 30. We see how God provides, how God opens up his hand. And all people are satisfied with good things. I do not know what that which pressed you into the house of the Lord. But I want us just to go before the Lord and tell him to minister to us. That the Lord will just minister to us. This God, he is very great. He is exalted in all the earth. Let's just go before the Lord. Bring that matter to him. Lay that burden at the feet of the cross. Let's pour out your heart to him. And just speak to the Father.
merciful to us tonight, O our God. Be merciful to us, O Jehovah God. Tonight, Lord, we plead for mercy, O God. Lord God Almighty, when we are afraid, we will put our trust in you, our God. When we are afraid, O God, we will put our trust in you, our God. Oh, Jehovah God, it is you who records our misery, O oh God. It is you who lists our tears on, our, on your scroll, O oh God. Are they not recorded? In, are they not in your record, O oh God? Lord, you know our tossing and our turning, O oh God. Lord, you have gathered our tears in a boat, Lord God Almighty. Are the records of our tears, Lord, not with you? And Lord, so we come tonight and we say, Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy on us tonight, O oh God. We run to you, our God. We run to you, our Savior. We run to you, our Redeemer. We run to you, our God. Lord, some of us are afraid, but Lord, we choose to trust in you. Lord, some of us are heavy laden, but we choose to trust in you. Lord, you see our sleepless nights. You, creator of the universe, you see our tears. You know our tears. You know the groanings of our hearts, oh God. We pray for mercy. Have mercy on us, O oh God. We thank you because, Lord, you have gathered our tears. You have gathered our tears in a bottle, O oh God. Is it not you, Lord, who keeps the records, O oh God? Lord, those tears, we cannot cry even in public. But, Lord, we wrap ourselves in our pillows, my Father. And we cry out to you tonight, Lord, we pray. Have mercy on us, O oh God. And so we run to you, we run to you. We run to you tonight. We run to the throne of grace. We run to the throne of mercy. You alone are our help. Lord, we do not have the help from the mountains. There is no help for us on the mountains. But our help is in you, you who made the heaven and earth. Come on, somebody cry out for mercy. Cry out to the Lord, he is our father. We are as sheep. We are the sheep of his pasture. We are his. He has called us by our names. We are his. We belong to the Lord. And Father, we lay our burdens up. We lay our burdens at the feet of the cross. We come, we come, we come. We come to you. He's able to do exceedingly. Abundantly above all that we ask, imagine. Or even think of according to your power that is at work in us. We come, we come, we come, we come. Oh God, you see our turning and our tossing. You know how we toss and turn at night. Lord God Almighty, you, are, you know our troubles. You who is with us in our troubles. We come tonight, we come to you tonight. We come to you tonight. We bring our tears to your sanctuary tonight. Lord, we come. Lord, we come, we come to the grave. Jehovah, we come tonight, we come to you. We come, we come, we run to the throne of grace. We come, we come. Oh, Rain down mercy, O God. Rain down peace. Rain down divine strength tonight in your presence. In your presence. In your presence. We come, we come. You are the strength of your people. You are their help, oh God. You are our help, Lord. We look to you. We look 
to you, we look to you. You alone are our help. You alone are our help. You alone are our help. La ba la ba 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 sh. Re kata la 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 ba 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 sh. Le 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 kata la 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 ba sh. Ro kata la 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 ba 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 sh. Le 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 kata la 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 ba sh. Re kata la la ba 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 sh. Le 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 ba sh. Mercy, mercy, Lord. Grace that grace may be multiplied. Oh God. Strength, Lord, strength upon strength in the name of Jesus. We look to you, oh God. We look to you. We look to you tonight. Re bala la ba 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 sh. Re kata la la ba 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 sh. Re le la ba 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 sh. Whom do we have on heaven and earth besides Him? There is none we have on heaven and on earth but besides Him, oh God. Our strength may fail, but you, O oh God, are the strength of our lives. You are the strength of our hearts. Oh, now and forevermore, we come to you. We come to you. Le ba ra ra ba ba ba, shi le le ba. Rika la 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 ba ba, shi le 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 ba, si la 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 ba si. Send help, Lord. Send help. We pray. Send help, Father. We cry. Send us help tonight. Mercy, mercy. Mercy, which is new every morning, Lord, send our way. Send to us your mercy. Send for all the help, Lord. We pray. We thank you because we are not of them without help. For you are the God who sends for the help. Lord, you send help. My God, my Father, you send help. You send help from your sanctuary. It is you who grants support from Zion. That tonight you may send help from San your sanctuary, O oh God. That you may grant us support from Zion, our God and our Father. Oh, we look to you. We look to you, our God. You are enthroned as the Holy One. You are the one. You are the one Israel praises. We praise you. We praise you. We run to you, Lord, in you, Lord, we put our trust. Lord, in you, we put our trust. Do not let us be put to shame. Do not let our enemies triumph over us. Lord, your word tells us that no one who hopes in you will ever be put to shame. Oh, Lord God Almighty, remember, Lord, your great mercy. And love for they are from of old. Oh, we come. We come to you, Lord. We come to you, O oh God. In you we put our trust, O oh God. In you, O oh God. We put our hope in you, O oh God. Only you are our hope. Lord, send forth help tonight, we pray. Let mountains melt like wax before you, O oh God. Let, let valleys be made as plain, O oh God. Oh, Lord, in your presence, mountains melt like wax you are the god of all power we come tonight let mountains melt let mountains melt like wax in your presence oh god let mountains melt like wax tonight who are you oh great mountain before zerubbabel you will become as a flame for the lord god almighty the god of heavens he melts mountains, he melts mountains, he causes wars to cease. Oh, this is our God, this is our God, might and power, might and power, might and power. This is our God, this is our God, this is our God, might to say, Oh, you ancient man, you ancient gates be lifted up. You ancient gates be lifted up. You ancient gates be lifted up. That the King of glory may come in. The Lord God Almighty. The Lord God Almighty is mighty in battle. He's strong in war. The Lord Almighty. He is 
Jesus' name. If you're sitting, I want us just to rise up. If you're sitting, let's just rise up uh, and just speak to Psalm, Psalm 24. We'll speak to every ancient mount, every ancient gate. Psalm 24. Media team, give me Psalm 24. Let's just speak to this mountain. Step verse from verse. From verse 7, let's just speak. Let's just speak to these things that have exalted themselves. That have exalted themselves. Lift up your heads, you gates. Let's just say, pray together. Lift up your heads, you gates. Be lifted up, you ancient doors. That the King of glory may come in. Lift up your heads. Lift up your heads, you gates. Be lifted up. I want you to speak to those gates. Be lifted up. Lift up your heads, oh, you gates. Name your gates and just speak to it. Lift up your heads, you gates. Be lifted up, you ancient doors. Be, be lifted up. Be lifted up that the King of glory may come in. Who is this King of glory? The Lord strong and mighty. The Lord mighty in battle. Who is this King of glory? Who is this King of glory? The Lord God, strong and mighty. The Lord mighty in battle. This is our God. Oh yes, oh yes, this is our God. This is our God, child of God. Let's just rejoice in the presence of God because this is our God. Strong and mighty. Lift up your heads, you guys. Come on, speak to those gates. You cannot leave, uh, leave this sanctuary tonight the way you came in. Those gates have to be lifted up. Those ancient doors have to be opened. Come on, somebody, let's just wage war in this place. Lift up your heads, you gates. Be lifted up. You ancient doors, that the King of glory may come in, that the King of glory, the King of glory may come in, the Lord strong and mighty, the Lord strong and mighty, this is your God, this is your God, this is our God, the Lord God Almighty, he is the King of glory, that the King of glory, that the King of glory may come in, that the King of glory, oh, you are the God of all glory. Take your glory. Take your glory. Ah, Lord God Almighty, the Lord strong and mighty. This is who you are. You are our God. You are our God. And we bless your name. We bless your name. We bless your name. We bless your name. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Lord, we bless your name tonight. For you are the King of glory. Take, take your place, O God, reign. The King of glory, strong and mighty. Strong and mighty, Lord God Almighty. Strong and mighty. We worship you. We give you praise, our God. May God arise and his enemies be scattered. May our God arise. May he arise upon our martyrs and his enemies be scattered. Hallelujah. Lord, we thank you for you are the king of glory. And Lord, not Lord God Almighty, tonight we choose to exalt you. We choose to exalt you for you are strong and mighty. You are the God of glory that we may see your glory. We walk out of this, we will walk out of this sanctuary knowing that you are the King of glory and you are waging war on our behalf. Blessed be your holy name. I want us just to continue in prayer just for a short while. I want us to pray for our nation. Let's just use this scripture again. Psalm 24 verse 7. Let's just speak upon our nations, our nation Kenya, and upon the church. We'll just pray for those two, and then we will move to the next item. Let's just speak upon the church, the body of Christ in this nation, and the global church at large. Let's speak over this nation that 
that these gates, ancient gates, will be lifted up. That the King of glory would reign over our nation. Come on, somebody, let's just pray. Speak over this nation, Lord. You are the God of this country, our God. And we speak to this ancient gates, things. Blessed is the nation. Blessed is the nation whose God is Jehovah. Let ancient gates be lifted up. Let ancient doors be opened. That the King of glory may take reign over our nation, over our roads, over our schools, over the peoples of this land. Lord, take your place. You are the God strong and mighty. That's who you are. That's who you are. That's who you are. That is who you are. Take your place, oh God. Reign over the 47 counties of this nation, oh God. Reign in power and in glory, Lord. Reign, 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 oh God. And let your enemies, the enemies of this nation, be scattered, oh God. Lord, we have thrown you on high as the king over this land. You are the king over this land. Kenya belongs to you. Kenya belongs to you. This nation belongs to you. This nation is yours, oh God. This nation belongs to you. Oh, we rise up a banner to the God of this nation. Our leaders belong to you. And like the waters of the rivers, you direct them in the way that they should go. We make, an, we make intercession for our leaders tonight. We pray for wisdom upon them. Lord, this nation belongs to you. We root out every evil of corruption, of idolatry, oh God, that defiles the land. Yet this nation belongs to you. This nation is your people, a people called by your name. We are your people, oh God. This nation belongs to you. This nation belongs to you. Oh, take your place, take your place, take your place. Reign in our government offices, oh God. Reign in our parish churches, reign, Lord. Um, in the business community, reign in our schools. Reign in our health sector, my Father. Intervene in this health crisis, my God. Uh, Lord, reign, Lord, reign, Lord, reign, Lord, reign, Lord, reign. You reign in power and in majesty. We bless your name. We bless your name. We bless your name. We bless your name. And we thank you for the body of Jesus Christ in this nation. Lord, thank you for Sitam. Thank you, Lord, for every church, every church in this nation. Lord, we pray that righteousness, that righteousness and holiness, oh God, will prevail over the body of Christ in this nation. Lord, that we will be the souls, that we will be the light, that we will be the salt, that we will be the light, oh God. Rain, rain, Lord. We pray that we will be a people, a letters that can be read. We bless your name tonight. There is no one like you. There is none absolutely like you. You are the king of glory. We lift up our nation to you, O oh God, that you will reign over every county. You will reign in every arm of this government, the, gov the, ex the executive, the legislature, the judiciary, O oh God. Reign, for you are the king of glory. We pray for the church. The Lord, it will be letters, as Paul says, that can be read. The Lord, we will be salt and light to the dying world. Blessed be your name, O oh God, both now and forevermore. In Jesus' name we pray and give thanks. Come on, sit up the carol. Put your hands together for Jesus. I say, put your hands together for Jesus. Give him a shout in this place. I say, give him a shout of praise in this place. Let's just, let's just celebrate the Lord in this place tonight. Hallelujah, hallelujah. 
You may have your seats in the presence of the Lord. Worship team, stay with me. Don't go. Don't go. Praise the name of the Lord. Praise Jesus. It is good to be in the presence of the Lord. It's a song that says that we will be blessed because we came. And may that be our portion in Jesus' name. Amen. I want to invite um, and recognize anyone visiting with us for the very first time. If this is your first time to be in this fellowship, in this prayer meeting, let me see by a show of hand. So now I am getting, yes, there's that brother, praise the Lord, let's just appreciate, there's that other one, wonderful, I see two of them, did I miss out on someone else? Yes, the Ash, the welcome team is going to give you a brochure, please, fill it in and drop it in the offering basket, we want to know you more. And then we'll get in touch so that you also get to know us. We meet here every Wednesday from 6 to 7.30 for prayer. And then we meet on Sundays from 7.30 for a time of prayer. And then our service starts at 8.30, our first service. Our second service starts at 11.30. I am your most welcome. And if you're searching for a church, church, what do we tell them? Your search has come to a blessed and kariboni sana it's time to give i want to invite the worship team to uh, praise the lord with a song even as we give i want to invite the ushers to wait on us um we will give um if you have um hard cash you can bring it over to the offering basket if you have soft cash you can send it to our pay bill number 933-944 account offering tithe um, that which you want to say sometimes I you, yes I think that's enough shall we thank God for the giving of his people Lord we are so grateful that you would gather us in your presence tonight just to be with you to take some time to praise you to worship you to listen to you and Lord, even to raise a cry to you. And thank you because we know that you are listening. And Lord, we have come into your house, not empty-handed. But Lord, as we give, we know that there are some who didn't have anything to give. We pray that Lord, you will provide for them. That next time they come into your sanctuary, they will not come empty-handed. And Lord, we thank you. That during the seasons, Lord, tough economic times, Lord, you have continually provided for us in small and in big ways. We give you praise. And Lord, as we give, we give cheerfully to you, O oh God. Bless every giver. Bless everyone who is tasked with the responsibility of ensuring that this is used for the furtherance of your kingdom. Bless them. We honor you and we bless your name. In Jesus' name we pray and give thanks. Amen. Karibuni, worship team.
Lord, you are the King of Zion, that you would reign, that you would reign, O God, in power and in majesty. Blessed be your holy name, O God, both now and forevermore. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. Amen. Let's appreciate our worship team. Let's make it louder. Let's make it louder until they sit down. Thank you, worship team. Thank you, worship team. Praise the name of the Lord. Come on, talk to me. Praise the name of the Lord. God is good and all the time. Amen. I want to share briefly. I am hoping I can do that in 10 minutes. I, 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 I would want us also to have some time of ministry. Just have time to pray for one another. Praise the name of the Lord. So I pray that God helps me. Uh, I have 20, 40 minutes. Not 40. How many? 20. I pray that God helps me. I know that sometimes we come into the place of prayer broken. And sometimes you pray and you pray and you don't feel like you're praying. Sometimes you just want someone to hold your hand and pray with you. So I want us to just, I want to, to share briefly and then we get some time for ministry. Praise the name of the Lord. Turn, turn with me to the book of Ephesians, chapter 1, verse 15 to 23. Ephesians chapter 1, verse 15 to 23. I'm reading from the NIV version. And the Bible says, For this reason, ever since I heard about your faith in the Lord Jesus and your love for all God's people, I have not stopped giving thanks for you, remembering you in my prayers. I keep asking that the God of our Lord Jesus Christ, the glorious Father, may give you the spirit of wisdom and revelation so that you may know him better. I pray that the eyes of your heart may be enlightened in order that you may know the hope to which he has called you, the riches of his glorious inheritance in his holy people and his incomparably great power for us who believe. That power is the same as the mighty strength he exerted when he raised Christ from the dead and seated him at his right hand in the heavenly realms. Far above all rule and authority, power and dominion, and every name that is invoked, not only in the present age, but also in the one to come. And God placed all things under his feet, and appointed him to be the head, to be head over everything for the church, which is his body, the fullness of him who, who fills everything in every way. I have um, titled um, what we are about to share, the revelation of his power. Say with me, the revelation of his power. We can make it louder. The revelation of his power. Paul, writing to the Ephesians, um, he's praying for them since he heard of their faith in the Lord Jesus Christ and the love for all the saints. And in his prayer, from verse um, eight, from verse um, 18, I'll just go straight into it, okay? He says that he prays that the eyes of their heart may be enlightened in order that they may know a few things. One, the hope to which God has called them. Two, the riches of his glorious inheritance in his holy people. Three, his incomparably great power for us who believe. I will not talk about um, the two, but I want to stay in verse 19. The incomparably great power for us who believe. Praise the name of the Lord. Many times when believers are going through difficult seasons, 
This is what the enemy challenges. He challenges if your God, if my God, if our God is powerful. He challenges the incomparably great power of God for us who believe. And so the enemy, many times, he will oppress us. He will put us into a place of being, feeling downcast, laid down, discouraged, depressed, and all those things. And that, this is what is, in, is challenging at that point. Because you feel hopeless, helpless, powerless. You know, all those less. There's, there's no help for you. But yet, Paul tells the believers in Ephesus that there is, there is incomparably, just stay with me there, don't go. There is incomparably great power for us who believe. And up there, we had read that Paul was praying for the spirit of wisdom and, and revelation. And the eyes of their may be enlighten and that is the prayer i pray for us tonight i pray for myself i pray for you my sister and my brother that our eyes will be enlightened that we may see and know his incomparably great power why let me show you when we continue let's go to verse 20. this power that is incomparably great power for us who believe. The Bible says this power he exerted when he raised Christ from the dead. Let's just stay there. So this power is the same power that brought Jesus Christ from the dead. Praise the name of the Lord. Praise Jesus. Bwana Yesu asifiwe kanisa. Hallelujah. This power brought Jesus, it raised Christ from the dead. Hallelujah. So when the enemy is oppressing you, making you feel helpless, I want you to remember this. You have incomparably great power because you believe you are a believer. And that power is the same one that brought Jesus Christ from the dead. Hallelujah. Are you feeling excited like I am right now? At that point, even when the enemy has oppressed you, put you down, put you in a place where you feel like you are sinking, the power, the incomparably great power has not disappeared. It has not gone on vacation. It has not gone on holiday. It is still there. Praise the name of the Lord. The same power that brought Jesus Christ from the dead. Number one. Number two. That power did something else. We continue. It seated him at his right hand in the heavenly realms. Let's continue. Far above all rule and authority, power and dominion, and every name that is invoked, not only in the present age, but also in the one to come. Let's continue. And God blessed all things under his feet and appointed him to be the head over everything for the church, which is his body the fullness of him who fills everything in every way. That incomparably great power that is in you, that is in me, that is in every believer, is the same power like the one that brought Jesus Christ from the dead. And then number two, it sat him on the right hand side of the Father, in heavenly realms, not, on, not in earthly realms, see your hapachini, in heavenly realms, far above what? Number one? Uh-huh. 
Let's go there. Yes, far above, rule. Number two? Number three? Number four? Number five? And most of the times when we are going through challenging times, it is rule that is over you. A rule, there's something, you feel like there's something that has taken rulership over you. I feel like there is an authority. This thing has become so hard. It's like a power, a dominion. Praise the name of the Lord. But that power, the incomparably great power, when the enemy is challenging that power, it has not gone anywhere. Praise the name of the Lord. Praise the Lord. No rule, no authority, no power, no dominion. No name invoked in the present age and in the age to come. At AI and the next world. Praise the name of the Lord. I do not have the right words to explain that. But that power is still in you. Let me show you something. Let's go to, I am concluding. Let's go to verse chapter 2. Verse, the same book, Ephesians, chapter 2, verse 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, and 10. All right, let's see where we'll get to. But because of his great love for us, God... who is rich in mercy, made us alive with Christ even when we were dead in transgressions. It is by grace you have been saved. And God raised us up with Christ and seated us with him in the heavenly realms in Christ Jesus. Now, let, let's just stay there. Let's, let's stay there. Friends, God raised us with Christ. Praise the name of the Lord. We were raised with who? Christ. And we are seated, and God made us to sit with him in the heavenly realms in... I think I have finished. You got the point? You got it? You got it. Let's go back to chapter 1. Incomparably great power for us who believe is like the same power that brought Jesus Christ from the dead and seated him in heavenly, in the, uh, at the right hand of the Father in the heavenly realms. Then we go to verse, chapter 2, verse 6. Is it 6? Yes. He says, he raised us up with Christ. That same power that brought Jesus Christ from the dead also brought us out forth from, ah, praise the name of the Lord. Christ did not, he, he was raised. But that same power, brothers and sisters, raised us up also. He raised me up. He raised you up. That power, that incomparably great power, that in salvation does is a, is a wonder, is a wonder. That power will bring us forth from the dead. And we were brought, we were raised up with Christ. And that power, not only did it make Christ sit at the right hand of the Father, in the heavenly places, but the Lord tells us, this scripture tells us that even us, even me, even you, my sister and my brother, Christ, we were, we are seated, God, not, God sat us with himself in the heavenly realms in Christ Jesus. Shall we stand? There is no power in hell no scheme of man, no rule, no authority, 
no principality, no dominion that can take away the incomparably power for us who believe. Praise the name of the Lord. Are you in this place? And you feel like you want someone to hold your hand because you're trying to reach out to that power and you feel like you're sinking. Please, my pastor, let's just come. Let's just come to the front. Let's just minister to the people of God. And you feel that word sounds good. The elders, please, deacons, just, just, just come. Let's just, let's just pray together with the people of God. And you feel like that, that word sounds nice. But I don't feel it. I am trying. I am trying to believe. I am trying to reach out. Worship team, you can come back. I am trying. Just come. Come. Let's just pray. Let someone pray with you. Let someone just pray with you tonight. There is no power. There is no authority. There is no dominion. There is nothing. There is nothing. Worship team, you can give us a worship song as we just take and, and, and out there. Let's just continue to speak. Let's respond to the scripture in prayer. Did you come to the house of God broken hearted? Did you come to the house of the Lord feeling heavy laden? Just come. Chains are 
that scripture again for this reason ever since I heard about your faith in the Lord Jesus Christ and your love for all God's people I have not stopped giving thanks for you remembering you in my prayer I keep asking that the God of our Lord Jesus Christ the glorious father may give you the spirit of wisdom and revelation that you may know him better father 
we have been taught this evening so powerfully of where we are seated with you far above the rulers and the principalities and the powers of darkness of this world father we pray that you will open the eyes of our understanding that we may see not just with our physical eyes not just with our heads but with our hearts with our spirit that we may live in this reality in the reality that we are though we are on this earth we are not a powerless people though we are on this earth we are not a people who should be trampled upon by the evil one because god we are seated with you oh god open the eyes of our understanding give us a spirit of wisdom and revelation to walk in this truth because if we walk in this truth we will defeat the devil and his works in our lives we will cause will command him out of our situation because we know where we sit because we know of the power that works within us pray for yourself one more prayer just ask open the eyes of my understanding oh god let me grasp this truth that there is a power in me that work that raised christ from the dead that i'm seated with christ in heavenly places and therefore i cannot live a defeated life i cannot be defeated by the devil whichever angle he comes to me god pray i pray that you open the eyes of our understanding that we may live truly in the victory oh god that you purchased for us oh give us understanding give us understanding oh god cause our hearts to see this truth we bless your name we bless your name in jesus name we pray amen come on put your hands together for emma for such a powerful powerful devotion once again thank you so much for coming for our evening service we meet on friday as we said on sunday we are having a play the judgment seat is an evangelistic play bring your neighbors bring your friend take them out for free and they may just give their lives to christ it's such a powerful powerful play so come come here at 6 30 for this play and then you can go home it's a short play i'm sure by in an hour now one and a half we will be done and out of this place amen let me release you may the lord bless you and may the lord keep you may the lord cause his face to shine upon you and be gracious to you now and evermore father see your people have come to your presence father thank you for the refreshing thank you for the word thank you for the time of prayer and worship as we go back to home we pray that we go with your blessing we go with your presence with our different needs that brought us to this place we know you have heard our prayers all those who pray believing and trusting in jesus name amen and now may the grace jesus christ and the love of god and the fellowship of the holy spirit be with us now and forevermore amen god bless you god bless you god bless you friday and all our children grade six seven and eight on saturday we are here even WM and Men's Ministry on Saturday.